as the coach at Appalachian State. And the opening kickoff, Travis Levy to receive it for BC. Up near the 20 for Levy and just passed it on a return for Travis Levy. It's a tempo offense, too. Quickly back over the ball. Back-to-back -back big plays for Big Robinson. Cardinals much better on third down D, but this time it's a first down for Boston College over the middle. Kobe White has the catch from Anthony Brown. Right easy across the middle, easy throw, an easy catch. Another pass, another catch. This is Dylan down the sidelines. May have stepped out of bounds in our CPI security red zone for BC on third and one. They're going up the middle with David Bailey. BC 11th in the conference with those numbers in red zone offense. They're going to give it to Dillon. Continues to fight his way. Now Louisville comes out of the pile with the football. Well, not funny if you're a Boston College fan, but last year at NC State, a very similar situation happened. A.J. Dillon, where Boston College, the running back, was fighting for extra yardage near the goal line. Ball came out. NC State got it. He scores there. Everybody in Boston College is happy. They didn't blow a whistle. If this happens, though, and never down and never heard a whistle. So I don't see how any review can overturn this. So there is an ongoing review. After contact, just like the big backs, from Boston College. On second and six, that is caught past the 40 and up past the 45 yard line. Dez Fitzpatrick. Evans, the kind of guy they want to build a program around here. The junior from Farmington Hills, Michigan, do, does a good job in the middle going up and then turning and getting all the all that he can. But you know what? Early in the season, he wasn't catching a lot of it. And those 286 yards through the air, a career high for Cunningham. To the ground and Hawkins. Hawkins to the 20. One man to get by and shoved out of bounds. Jamie and Hawkins down shifting to the five yard line. Win what they do best. That is now four rushes over 40 yards. Look at him get outside. Turn on the Jets. Four rushes over 40 yards. Scores with 10 touchdowns. On second and goal. Cunningham racing to that front corner and he's got it for the touchdown. A three yard TD run. Mikhail, Malik, Richie Cunningham, whatever you want to call it. That was showtime right there. Down in six now. A lot tougher for the offensive call. Time to throw. Touch on it. Complete past the 25-yard line. And that's Hunter Long. Third down gains after they've got him stuffed early in the drive. Had to stop that passing game now. 13 yards of the previous play and a wide open man is Hunter Long. Long inside the 20. Long to the goal line, and he's in for the Boston College touchdown. Brown to Long, 72 yards. James Bates, 72 yards on the play. Yeah, there's a play fake to A.J. Dillon. Everybody's focused on him, but not that focused to where Long can be that wide open. And it's off to the races. Good hustle by Yeast, but all for nothing. We're tied at seven right here in the loop. A selfish football team. They've got to play as a team. They've got to play as best friends and teammates, and they've done that so far here today. Play fake from the Cardinals and an open man. 2-2 two -two Atwell is number one, and he's got the catch. Defense couldn't get off the field. It was the difference. Can they hear? They'll throw it. Complete. Dawkins. He'll go into the end zone untouched and uncontested. 59 yards and a Cardinals touchdown. The blitz is picked up. You don't see that back there. The time is there for Cunningham, and he lays it out there just perfectly for Seth Dawkins to run underneath it. it was recovered and taken by Monty Montgomery, and they turned it into points. Second down. Bailey, the edge, and the first down. Where are those sticks? Where are they trying to run those routes right now? Incomplete. Lathered up. Grant Carlson punts for Boston College to J.V. and Hawkins from the 22. Hawkins drags it 
Drags a couple of BC players up to the 30. Which across the way was just that at the University of Florida. Coach Satterfield plays a big role in the play calling as well, and this one did not go as planned. Rossio on the play. Rossio just unblocked. Good job of doing his job. In third down situations. Deep into the play clock. Cunningham, quick trigger, and that one is complete past the 45-yard line. 2-2, two -two. Atwell was open, made the catch, and the sticks are going to move for Louisville. Abby, thank you for that. Adonis Boone with the new guard in there. Little pitch play now. Hall. And the pitch was not clean. It's a loss of one for the Cardinals. That's an excellent job. Four plays. Guards with the ball to start the second quarter. Cunningham has to freelance. Shakes him in at the 48. And it's a Boston College territory. He's going back out there now, and look, you've got him bottled up, good coverage in the secondary, and he just slips out. And then he slips past many would-be tacklers. See through a 72-yard touchdown pass to Hunter Long from Anthony Brown in the first quarter. Levy signals for the fair catch. Backs up to the 11 and makes it successfully. You think of this running game for Boston College, you think of these backs delivering blows, they've been hit hard every time they're tackled. You know, Tom, I mean, it's like defensively, you've seen a lot of physicality, a lot of big licks from guys like Kane Pass. Boston College averages 252 yards per game on the ground, best in the conference, and 13th in the nation. This is a long pass play. Brown caught in stride and down to the 20-yard line. Zay Flowers got behind that secondary, and Chandler Jones brought him down. First four rushes. And here he's just rushing on past the defender, standing flat-footed. What a beautifully thrown football by Anthony Brown. Usually those big hitters work really well when the running game is really working, really pounding. Oh. What a collision there. David Bailey and C.J. Avery, 53 yards. Well, his defensive coordinator, also a Mississippian yesterday, Brian Brown, told us all kinds of contact right there, the junior from Grenada, Mississippi. This is Anthony Brown. First down and more for Brown. I hate to see that for anybody. Anthony Brown worked so hard to get healthy. Dennis Grossell is in at quarterback. He's got to hand it off. And down that 10-yard line goes Ben Glines. And that's a loss of three. He's going to have a chance, it looks like, here today the rest of the way, perhaps. Seeing action in his sixth game of the season. Throws the pass down to the goal line. And a touchdown. Adrizzi has the catch. Ten yards for BC on the pass by Grossell. On his first TD pass. The fake. And Adrizzi. It's just that easy. How about that? One for one in this game. We're tied. And there's Cunningham on the sidelines. That's out to Thomas Jackson. That's first down yardage for Louisville. It's a run. Hawkins. Hawkins inside the 20. And down close to the 10-yard line. They'll mark Hawkins out at the 12. Richardson forced him out after 32 yards. Different style. The two backs for Louisville compared with the guys from Boston College. But the same motor and the same drive. Both Hawkins and Hall run with a purpose. Gardles. Into the pile with Hawkins. Gotta hold your water defensively, Tom. Can't jump yep. offside. They're gonna run it up the middle and into the end zone. JV and Hawkins did the heavy lifting on that drive, and he caps it off with a three-yard TD run. For Hawkins, his second rushing touchdown of the season, right up the middle and into the end zone. Rossell just got it away, incomplete. Cunningham has a TD pass and run in the game. Hawkins has some space. And he falls across the 40-yard line. JV and Hawkins, 21 yards. That pass by Cunningham, his first incompletion of the game. He's now 5 of 6 through the air. 
Wants to throw it. They're two for four on third down. Now they're going to be two for five. Mason King. Levy. Near the 16-yard line with a fair catch. The punt by King was 41 yards. Off the field here on a third down and nine. Rossell was pressured. Amante Caban, number 53, and a senior. Burns shields his eyes from the sun and backtracks. Just inside the 30. Burns to midfield. Rajay Burns breaks the tackle at the 40. Penalty markers are out. Burns inside the 10 and finally goes down at the three-yard line. There is a flag on the play. The return by Burns was 56 yards, and Ella Track made the tackle short of the goal line. Mikhail Cunningham, the handoff is Hall. Traffic jam on the mass turnpike, and a loss of three yards. The flag was already down, so it wasn't on that. Cunningham throws, complete Dawkins. Dawkins inside the 20, and Dawkins inside the 10. My goodness, how big is this stop now? And just back there, just guys getting lost defensively. And it's just been too easy time after time. And a couple titles goes to the house as well. And here under two minutes in the first half. To the end zone and in, Hassan Hall kept his footing and he scores for the Cards from six yards out. Field's team went 80 yards in 39 seconds, James. Look at the guys up front, just, just owning that defensive front. Left the game with a knee injury right after the first quarter. Dump off, Grossell to Burt. And he has spun down to the turf. Home after the pump fake the other way. The Carroll City Chief, good open field tackle. Loss of three, previous play. They've got a connection here, though. It's Jake Burt. And he's into Louisville territory inside the 45. As Kane Pass made the tackle. Going to try to get after the quarterback with a rush. Three of seven on third down. Grossell's pass inside the 30. Hunter Long made the catch. First down, Boston College. Two-minute offense, a time or two back in Boston at practice. There's a nicely thrown football and a good job by Long to go get it. See that target line for Boston College for a potential field goal. This pass is complete to Flowers. He's down to the 18-yard line. He gets out of bounds. Boomer over there getting ready in case they need him. Grossell looking left all the way to the end zone. And caught for a touchdown, Kobe White snares it for the Eagles, 13 yards. The way that Louisville had just grabbed a hold of all the momentum in this stadium, enormous that they can drive with Grossell at quarterback and punch it in like that. Problems on the snap for the extra point. That's Grossell, throws it into the end zone. Hunter Long. That's not how you draw it up, but they'll take two points. And a great job to make the call, whatever it is, you yell. You, you yell. The TD catch, James, of the season for Kobe White and Grossell is 6 of 11, 75 yards, and two TDs. Deep pass for the Cardinals. And the flag comes out. Living to play another down instead of a great big touchdown to answer. Cunningham over the middle. Justin Marshall. Louisville running the fast break. They pass in plenty of time for Cunningham. Third down for the Cards. Looking for a quick strike and out of bounds. And Seth Dawkins has another catch. Freaky to add three more for the Cardinals. From 44 yards away. No good. He's in. Everybody's going to chaos. Smoothies. 
9 of 12 and 227 yards passing in the first half for Cunningham. That's a third down play, and there's no gain. Big. Didn't see much of that in the first half, so a good job with the adjustments. Good job of firing it up early in the first half by the B.C. defense. Yeah, the 20, Levy. Got away from the first wave. And Levy takes it out past the 40-yard line. 172 then. And there's the season, and there's today. The 10 carries and 34 yards, but watch out. First down and more for Dillon. That season average per game is the best in the ACC. Four of eight on third down for Boston College. Third and five. Bailey. Substitutions. It is fourth and short. Grossell trying to get it. They need about a yard. Maybe the 34-yard line. And now Louisville thinks it has the football. Where progress was stopped. First and ten, Boston College. Grossell puts on the brakes and launches it to the end zone to no one. There is a penalty marker in the Louisville secondary. Cause a lot of damage. Toyota lets go places with A.J. Dillon. Grossell on second down, floats it to the end zone. And a touchdown, Boston College. A treasy as his second TD grab. Right before the half, they had to go for two because Grossell couldn't handle the snap. Well, he handles this situation quite well and puts some touch on it, James. Yeah, he did. We've seen him throw it a little hard at times, and this time he does just that, Tom. He's got the pressure in his face. He doesn't panic. He's going to take a hit. He does. Drops it right in there. Beautifully thrown by the sophomore. Done quite well. Dennis Grossell. Three TD passes. Boston College has taken the lead. 29-28. What a football game. Coming out of the end zone hall. Ball to the 30, cut it back at the 35, and he stumbles and tumbles down beyond the 40-yard line. They'll mark him up there at the 43. That return was 43 yards. Here's Cunningham and company trying to go answer now. Cunningham has all day. Lines it up. Catch near the 15-yard line. Des Fitzpatrick elevates and secures the football. Thing to pay off for big number seven. Had seven catches, 133 yards, and a touchdown against FSU. Got the big hand up and the big body to lodge it loose. And too late getting there is Mike Palmer. Another big play for this Louisville offense. They got 41 yards on the catch. This is Cunningham. Angles out of bounds. No fumble call. <laughs> the flag was dropped, or was it? There was one down on the ground, but they decided to pick it up. Louisville fans like that one a little bit more here in Louisville. All in all, the ball gets moved back 25 yards. And this could be a loss as well as Hawkins, Hawkins runs into Max Richardson. What's that play clock? Yeah, just did get the snap away with two on the clock. They'll swing it out. Safe play to Hawkins. He'll drag that pile four yards away in the first half. 34 yards away. Freaky makes no mistake. The greatest Muhammad Ali in that robe that he would wear with that block lettering. The black and white. And the red gloves as well. As Levy returns it, spins his way past the 30. And up near the 40-yard line for Travis Levy. 36 yards on the return. Grossell lets it go. Attempted one-arm grab near the sideline. Good job on the cover team and a good job getting off the field defensively for Louisville. Carlson punts. Rajay Burns trying to run it down. Fields it at about the two. Oh. Interesting decision by Burns. 54 yards on the punt. Burns takes one out of the end zone. Just in, in, a little bit of what looked to be like a panic mode almost. He needs to let this one go over his head, out the back of the end zone. Dealing with the sun is, is showing that you can win. And, and coming from a winner, Scott, Scott Satterfield at Appalachian State. It's a winning play, James. Up to the 20 and a first down, a late flag. Tail under the play, 2-2 at well. Here's a backup now for Louisville, Evan Conley. 
Conley was two of three passing in the first half. This is a strike. 30-yard line in Des Fitzpatrick. In place of Juwan Pass being evaluated in the medical tent. Hassan Hall looking for an avenue. He's making the play. Watch, see if you can see the end of it. Watch here on the, on the edge of the line. Watch 60. There's our guy. Big right tackle, Tyler Haycraft. For the Cardinals, this is third and eighth. Pressure. Quick throw near the 45-yard line and a first down, 2-2 Atwell. Mm, nice throw. It should have been completing a big play. Paul, oh, nowhere to go. Boston College, they had it red. Paul Theobald. Both these teams, especially for the Eagles here today, but they got to find a way to shut it down. Catch made. Down to the 32-2 at well. Blitz is there. They bring the bodies and they pick them up. A great job. Late pressure for Conley. Stands in there strong and puts it right out there for Atwell. Complete. Fitzpatrick to the end zone. Conley to Fitzpatrick. Touchdown card. Again, freshman has to come in back up. Nobody gets there. He lets Des come across and then doing the rest of the work is big number seven. See, just letting it clear out and then overrunning was the defender Barlow. The guy assigned to cover him there. 23 yard play to Des Fitzpatrick and those receivers have stepped it up today. You're right, Abby. What a performance. This is Levy. On the return performance is the ball out at the end of the play. Are they signaling it down? That appears to be the initial signal as Levy had the return of 43 yards for BC. Takes it from out of his end zone, just running hard to set his offense up. Here's another look at the end of the play. Protecting that football, it certainly looked like it. But a, a defender underneath him. So if they are looking at this, it, it could get more interesting than they think, but I think they're going to get the snap off here. Down and three. The time for Grossell at the 25 intercepted. Anthony Johnson for the Cardinals with the pick. Big turnover. Quarterbacks for BC that haven't thrown any interceptions until last week through two. Brown through two. Here's the first of this game and just underthrown. Passes are from Cunningham. Mikhail Cunningham shovels it forward. This may go down as a pass and a loss. We'll wait for the official scoring on that play. Cunningham's pass. Incomplete. Leaping attempt from Des Fitzpatrick. Good stand here by the Eagle defense. Levy is deep. And Levy catches it, rolls out of bounds near the 30-yard line. That punt was 37 yards. And now for this game, the teams have combined for 1,001 yard, and we'll add to that total with Dillon. A.J. Dillon, second level, and he's pushed to the turf. Short of the 30-yard line. Was there. The Cardinal defense has been able to keep him bottled up for the most part. And look at him dance. Goes airborne, puts his feet on the ground and cuts. And he can really get going fast when he gets a full head of steam, carrying bodies with him. We're in the fourth quarter. Got to stay clean. Got to keep it clean. Stay in this fight. Misdirection gadget play for Levy. Running towards the goal. And Levy is into the end zone, just inside the pylon. 37 yards for Travis Levy. Watch Big Lindstrom get up and move. That's a, that's a big old boy. Wraps that arm around a little bit. The white glove blends in nicely with that white jersey. Nobody sees it. And there's the push at the very end, but inside that pylon. I've been impressed with the, the hustle. Play, gadget play, whatever you want to call it, it worked. 
for the Eagles to cut the lead to two, 38-36. Conley sets, delivers a strike. Fitzpatrick, first down, Cardinals, 10 yards. Staying on his toes and flipping those hips as that cushion starts to collapse. Conley over the middle. Catch made by Atwell. Is that Marcus Valdez? The defensive end is back there turning and running. It looked like trying to cover one of the speediest guys on the field. Man, that's, that's a tough assignment for the defensive end. Don't always try to go for the, the loss. Tackle him at the goal line at just that angle. Play never really developed for Hawkins, and the exchange didn't look all that smooth between the two either, and a loss of two. He's played in a couple of games this season. Pressure was coming, and Conley just kind of lofts it up there, and it bounces near the 10. In the first half, he's up to 96 for the game, and Dennis Grossell has come on in relief of Anthony Brown, who injured his knee in the first half. Upended at the 30. Oh. With some positive yardage here on the ground. Dylan spins away from a tackle and then gets dumped. The guy with the first interception on the year is going to be okay. Here's another look at Dylan. I mean, after that initial hit, this run, and it's first down and 10. Flowers couldn't turn the corner. Yasir Abdullah. Go 22. Carroll City Chief taking on that block, keeping him off of you with your hands, and then fighting to drop him. They trying to get here, and running and breaking off those routes. Rossell takes off up there midfield. He's into Louisville territory, about a yard short of the marker. It was, and he had the lead block of services anyway. Of Bailey, he'll fall backwards. Now it's going to be marked where that, that butt goes down, which looks to be right about even with that stick. Now on fourth down and six, they'll keep him out there. Rossell rolls it right, throws, and complete. And that's a first down for Boston College. Kobe White makes the catch. The sticks, puts his feet down, slams on the brakes to make sure he goes past, and here comes Dillon. A.J. Dillon. Ten or more yards on that run. Back-to-back -back first downs, Boston College. Give A.J. Dillon 12 yards on the rumble. Here we are, 38-36. Dillon. Would be a career long for Brumary. Brumary knocks it through for B.C. 45-yard field goal. If they want to snap this nine-game ACC losing streak, he's got to march him down. That pile just keeps on moving. Yeah, Somebody gotta, lost the helmet yeah, in there, they too. they got to blow the whistle because they, they yeah. got to call a play dead when a helmet's off like that. So Bennerman has to come in for Ram. He's 98 for BC. This pass complete. Seth Dawkins makes his way towards midfield. First down. Conley hands it off. Hawkins, first down and more. Hawkins down near the 20-yard line. Tavian Hawkins. The offensive line blow it up on the right side. Great vision and great cut to get out there. And then it's 2-2 Atwell. And then it's Des Fitzpatrick blocking down the field. Extra emphasis on trying to rake it away. Uh-oh. Ball's on the turf. Scooped up by the cards. Tyler Haycraft was there to cover. There is a loss of one. For the field and hurt that he was in the right spot of the field as this one hits the ground after it's right there in the mix-up. And boy, you know, how many offensive linemen are going to try to scoop and score? He, 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 had, he had big plans, didn't he? I mean, most offensive linemen are going to jump down on that. Third and 11. Conley. Receiver cut the route short. And it's incomplete. And field goal percentage makes. 41 yards away, Creaky. To give the cards the lead. 
He's done it. 41-yard field goal, Blanton Creaky, and his second of the day. A lot of help from J.D. and Dawkins and company. There's the snap, the hold. 102 on the clock. What an afternoon, James, in Louisville, Kentucky. Tom, they got to they start right here on this play. If Levy gets it, they need to shut it down. Blinds. And he'll fight his way to the 25, and he'll be stopped at about the 24. Dennis Grossell is back up. He's in charge of this offense right now at 55 seconds. Punch one down, maybe draw a penalty flag at some point. Grossell on the run. That's complete to Flowers. Steps out of bounds beyond the 30-yard line. Nice quick out of bounds here, a third down and one with 45 picks remaining. Uh-oh. Dillon stopped short. In fact, he lost the yard. First down for the Eagles, 38 seconds to go. They are out of timeouts. Grossell throwing off the back foot, and that's too far for Zay Flowers. 33 seconds now. Grossell only three completions this half. This is a desperation toss that is well out of bounds. Almost took a sack there, so smart to get rid of it. Looking and looking. Grossell won't get to the marker. 45-yard line. They got to go. Fourth down. Can't spike the football. Need to go for it. Final seconds. Grossell got it away. It's incomplete. An outstanding job when they were asked to fill in. But for Evan Conley, he's your winning quarterback, your winning backup, and Scott Satterfield and these Louisville Cardinals hard work paying off after nine straight ACC losses. They get a big old win here in Louisville today.